What's going on guys? So today we are just going to be uh, patching up the uh, wing, the street faction wing, um, because uh, one time I was going with my friend and I forgot to bolt it back on and literally we were going like 10 miles per hour and it just, boom, it just fell on the floor. So um, yeah, I have, to, I have to patch it up. I don't think I've showed you guys the damage, but it's it's kind of bad and I have this like glue that is like heat protecting and it's like waterproof and all that good stuff and you know I, I really don't have time to be like patching it up like perfectly so this is the only way that I could do it and um, it's the only way that I want to do it right now because uh, I don't want water to get in it and um, that's the only way that I know of so let's uh, let's see how it goes and hopefully everything turns out good <laughs> Okay guys, so this is the uh, this is the glue that I'm going to be using. It's called the E6000 and um, you know, basically it's just like a, a adhesive that sticks onto uh, everything. This one's the clear one, so you're not really going to be able to see it. So this is the wing right here. This is the Street Faction wing. You guys already know I have this. I've been running this wing for like about a year already, but I recently took it off because of the um, the damage that I got from it and um, as you can see it opens up pretty bad um, it fell off the car while it was on the car it literally like just I was going like 10 miles per hour and just boom it hit the floor like really hard so I just want to glue it back on for right now um, and then hopefully down the line we can get like a different one but just for right now just so that water won't go inside it when I wash it or something and that's pretty much all the damage there was there wasn't any damage over here or in the frame itself um, there is a little bit more damage down here also but that's not like um, it's just like cracked it's not really uh, it's not broken so that's fine so I'm just gonna do the top real quick all right so there's the glue right here E6000 so inside it's just uh, like a nice clear glue. Um, directions, directions. So it says leave for 24 hours. So that's what I'm gonna do. Is I'm gonna leave it. I'm gonna leave it for like a bunch of days. So I'm not gonna be running it. So this is how it turned out. I literally used all the glue all around. As you can see, that's all the glue right there. It look, it smells like Play-Doh, kind of. I don't know if you guys ever um, like held like that, like Play-Doh stuff that looks like this, but it kind of smells like that. And um, it's not, it's not hard right now. It doesn't get hard until like a few hours. But right now it's kind of like squishy. As you can see it's like squishy. So it seems like it's working good. I'm just going to leave it like for a whole month and see how it looks. And then if I still have a whole bunch of bumps out here like this, I'm going to sand them down and make sure it's like, you know, flat. But other than that, it looks like it worked out pretty good. It doesn't, doesn't look like all like crazy. And the good thing is I used the clear clear glue because if I would have used the white one or the black one it would have been more noticeable. 